What's up guys, it's me Jackson and we're playing Ultimate Custom Night again. Now, this, this, this is the part now it's starting to get harder. Because we've got World Star Friday. And I might add an, an other animatronic will make God darn it. Alright, we've got a... Yeah, another one. Alright. Let's try that again. It was Golden Friday that jump scared me. Just pulled up the monitor. Don't waste any power. Yeah, 
I'm 15% power. Is the eye mine? Oh my god. Thank you. Alright. I'm gonna keep trying until I well like be all this. Cause I've already died two times now. That's all camera to make it harder. I mean, easy. <laughs> no! Go in, boy! No! No! <laughs> That's what I am like! Come on! Oh my god, that gave me a heart attack, man. I don't think we're gonna survive. Power. 
Pokémon. Special by Golden Freddy. Alright. Am I doing another animatronic? That was stressful. Oh my god. Freddy's too hard.
My friend, you have met a terrible, terrible demise. But, uh, you know, I, I don't Huffle? feel too bad about it. Wait, oh, After I forgot all, about if, this. If it weren't for me, it would have just been from oh, someone wait. else, you know? I oh, guess what I'm trying what? to say is life life goes on. Well, well for, POV, for everyone else, life you're goes the on. Not, States of America. not for you, you're, you're no, dead. You're the president That's neither of the here nor States there. Of America. It reminds me of one summer day in the park. I was having just a delightful picnic with my good friend Orville. And I said to him, I said, yeah. Orville, I, I have a story. And he said to me, what's the significance of the story? And you guys can all skip this. I said to him, Orville, not every story has to have significance. Just in case you're leaving you know, the video, bye-bye. Uh, you know, sometimes <laughs> a story is just a story. You try to read into every little thing and find meaning in everything anyone says, you'll just drive yourself crazy. I had a friend do it once. Wasn't pretty. We talked about it for years. And mm -hmm. not only that, but you'll likely end up believing something you shouldn't believe and thinking something you shouldn't think or, or assuming something you shouldn't assume, you know? Mm -hmm. Sometimes, I said, uh, a story is, is just a story. So just be quiet for one second of your life and eat your sandwich, okay? Of course, it was only then I realized I made sandwiches and poor Orville was having such difficulty mm -hmm. eating it. Oh. Elephants have those clumsy hands, you know? Mm -hmm. Actually, I, I suppose that's the problem. They don't have hands at all, do they? They're, they're all feet. And I, I couldn't imagine someone asking me to eat a sandwich with my feet. Now, if I recall correctly, there was a bakery nearby. Oh. I, I said to him, Orville, oh, let me go get you some rye bread. Now, I'm unsure if elephants enjoy rye bread, but I assure you that Orville does. Now, this was on a Tuesday, which was good because rye bread was always fresh on Tuesday. They made this sourdough bread on Monday and threw it out Wednesday. Or rather, they sold it at a discount for people wanting to feed the ducks. And then probably at the end of the day, finally, they threw it all out. I, I don't recall. I do remember a man who would bring his son to the bakery every Wednesday and then go feed the ducks. He would buy all of the sourdough bread. Of course, you know, you're not supposed to feed the ducks sourdough bread at all. It swells up in their stomach and then they all die. It, uh, at least, at least that's what I've heard. You know, I, I never saw any ducks die myself, but I did notice a substantial what? decrease in the duck population over the so course of a few years. So you're talking about Happy Frog. I just never thought to stop the man and tell him that he was killing the ducks by feeding them sourdough bread. And if you want my opinion on the matter, <laughs> or those and I told Orville this as well. If you want to feed ducks or birds or any kind for that matter, it's best to buy seed. I mean, okay. when you think about it, breads of any sort don't occur in nature. They don't grow on trees or spring up from the bushes. I don't think mm. birds know what to do with bread. What was I saying? Oh, oh yes, yes. So I bought Orville some rye bread. What a fine day it was. Well, okay, and uh, I'm gonna have to end the video here. I only beat it one night. I'll try to beat uh, Mr. Huffle Freddy and Rockstar Freddy again next time, which will be really hard. Or what about? I'll practice try try more to next time. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. And I might do one of the power ups, ladies' night. Why is Mango on there? He's a. Oh my goodness! I just said that he. Jane, ah uh, yes, that's my language. I've seen yes. <laughs> wait, wait. I don't really get that. Alright, okay. Alright, I'll give up. Alright.